What's up, guys? Desert B here, and welcome to the finale for The Wind Waker. I am so excited to be able to fight Ganondorf at the end of this temple. So we still have... Let's see, I'm pretty sure I did that one. So I think we just have this one to do. We're doing some boss rematches here uh, before for the big boss fight and let's head in so the last one we saved the last one for uh the best one for last because this should be yeah this is gonna be mulgara this looks like uh oh fairy did i want that no i guess not i've got grandma's soup and i've got a couple of fairies Jeez. oh nice glad to see i can shoot him through those spikes I hear another one, but he's like way back. Oh my gosh, I made that shot. <laughs> wow. Let's put the boots on and then what am I going to need after this? Maybe the leaf? Hold on, I hear something weird. Oh, I think it's just maybe some kind of underlying temple music. I'm not sure what that is. It's like temple music, kind of, but also Ganondorf's music. <laughs> kind of weird. Here's another switch. I don't know what the point. Oh, wait, this is... Oh, yikes, turn around. That's going to push me down. Okay, let me think about this. Let's see if this is important. Link, could you uh, maybe do this? I can't grab onto that. And this is just going to push me straight down. Yep, straight down into the abyss. Okay, so there's got to be a switch or something, maybe. Oh, no, the whiz robes are back. Come on, dude. Ugh. They're never close enough for me to hit them with my sword. Kind of satisfying to do that. Okay, what's the trick? What's the trick? Maybe there's something with this. Um, what's the big thing in the middle of the room, right? I can't grab it. And why would they put this here if you could climb? I guess to be launched up to go over the next gap, but... Yeah, you just really kind of bounce off of that. Let me see. Let me see. There's these guys. Um, but Link can't... Yeah, Link, there's no way we can grab those. They just seem to be for decoration. Let me refill the magics. Another fairy. Wow. I guess because I fell in the hole, it's all uh, refilled itself here. Okay, what? What, what, what? Okay, I'm not seeing... Oh, my gosh, you can go right between the two of them? Oh, hey, but... But, 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 what are these? But, hold on, I can't really reach the top, though. Let me see if anything happens when I defeat these guys. Uh, not really. Let me get the magic. Hold on. So let me see. Oh, the hookshot locations. Okay. We are in. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that was simpler. I was trying to find, like, a switch or something, but I didn't realize you could just, like, glide through those two whirlwinds. All right, here we go. Mulgara rematch. Let's see if I can do better at this one. Now, what 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 tools can I use for this? Uh, maybe just this? Hey, the music's a little bit different. Oh, uh, closer, Link. There we go. <laughs> the music's a little bit different this time. Interesting. It's like Ganon's Tower remix. Ooh. Oh, making a new hole. 
I'm just gonna try to go for it. What do you think? Oh, jeez. All right, all right, all right. Maybe I shouldn't do that. <laughs> yeah, this was by far my favorite boss fight of the whole game. At least until this point. And I don't know about... I had this problem before where the... Oops, oops, oops. No, 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 no. I don't know. These guys, like, you gotta hit them just right. And I think it's really gotta be the tippy tops of their heads. Otherwise, they've got, like, armor. And if you aim... Like, if you swing your sword too soon... See, watch. Let me see. Ugh. Anyways, these are just distractions anyways. Let's get on with the big boy. Oh, I want you to lock onto the tongue. Oh, boy. Oh, something happened there with that guy. Oh, I wonder what happened with that one. It, like, somehow stunned? Was it the hook shot? Let me try that. Let me try that. Oh my gosh, the hook shot! You can pull them out of the sand! Oh, Lord. You live and learn, right? Okay, let's do this right then. I want to pull them out of the sand. And then... No chomping today. There will be no chomping. Ooh! Okay, now that I know what to do about the little snakes, you guys don't stand a chance, honestly. Okay, well, that one evaded. What happened? Oh, he's out of the ground now. Now, what was the... <gasps> Hold on, I gotta remember. What was the um, trick to this phase? Or does he just go back into the sand? Oh, yeah. Okay. We've got a lock on. Oh, come on. There we go. Ooh. Come on, you wormy. Mini Mulgaras, I guess. Ah. Oh my gosh. He came out of the sand like right under me. <laughs> I think he might be upset. Oh, here he comes. I think I like the original version of the music a little bit better, but glad we get to hear it again. All right, what the heck? Come on, give me the, give me the hits. I think, there, you gotta get him in the face. Oops. Yeah, the sand, the sandworms here, they're pretty, they're pretty distracting. But you know what? If you can just get rid of them, it's honestly way easier to actually focus on Mulgara that way. What happened? Oh my gosh, why am I so close to the mouth? Ugh. Oh, we got the lock onto the tongue, but we... Nope. Okay, lock on, lock on. Yes, this... Nope, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna say that, so this might be it. But that was not it. Ooh, that took a lot of hearts. Okay. Let me just uh, grab the heart just as a precautionary backup. Okay. And that unlocks the door, the death door. Ooh! Spooky! Nice! Okay, let's see if there's any healing items or anything in these. I don't... I don't know what's next. I don't know whether to be... a little bit worried here, or... I don't know. I don't know if we're... I don't know where we're going. Oh, that's not it. Is this? Is that it? Yeah, because that's the exit. Okay. What's next in Ganon's Tower? Uh-oh. Ooh. 
We got the devil fawns. Hey, wow. Threw me over his shoulder like a sack of potatoes. Ooh. Interesting music. Look at that. Interesting big skull up there. So now... Now what? Okay, let's... This is the door I came in. This is probably the door I need to go through. But... We've got two choices. Let's start over here. Now what is this? Maybe the boots? Nope. Hmm. Okay, there I think these are switches. So let's um let me see what these do. Different symbols up on this uh the walls here. Oh, I wonder, let's see. Maybe you have to do these in a specific order. No, they all go right back off. What's this? Can't go. Hmm, okay, what's the deal here? How come I can't read whatever this says on the floor? Let me, let me look around. Okay. So... Deku... So this is the... I mean, this is the first one. That we did. Maybe you need to do them fast? I don't know. I mean, they seem to be... Is that the Poe? Oops. I mean, that would be the order that we completed them in, right? It'd be the... The Goma. The Deku Baba thingy. And then this one. And this one. Ooh, well, what to do, what to do. That did nothing. That didn't really seem to do anything either. Let me go in the other door. A little bit confused. Oh no, this looks the same. Well, not quite. Oh. They're numbered. Okay, I see it. And they're... I see it, I see it. You must remember well the appearance of this room, the shape of the floor, the number of items hanging on the walls. Such things are the keys to solving the riddles that lie ahead. Do not overlook anything. Oh, gosh. Okay, so it's one, two... So let me maybe memorize it by... So Mulgara... Uh, not Colgara. Uh, Goma. Baba. And then that thing. Oh, no, no, wait. No, Poe. Okay, so Mulgara. Goma. Poe. And now he said the floor, too. The shape of the floor. What does this say? The sword hilts of my servants who lurk deep in the darkness shall be the guideposts that point to me. Sword hilts of my servants, guideposts that point to me. Okay. I don't know. Let's go. So once again, Mulgara, Goma, Baba. No, no, Poe, then Baba. Mulgara, Goma, Poe. Okay. Now it's going to show me. <laughs> it's showing me the order. <laughs> okay. Cool. Mulgara. Let's switch to regular arrows here. And then Poe. And this one. Oops, I missed. What? Did I do it wrong? I mean... Huh. 
The markings in the floor. He said something about these mirror each other. What if I need to hit them with something else? I mean, that seems... Oh, 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 oh. This one. Let me do them in this order like this. See if this works. Maybe it'll be fast enough. There we go. Okay. Ooh. Oh, it's the king of red lions. What are you doing in here? I see. So this is the portal through which Ganon was able to seep into the unsuspecting world above. Link, we shall, we shall make use of this path that Ganon created for himself. If there's anything from the world above that you believe you need, then climb into the bow and enter the column. Hold on. If there's anything from the world above you believe you need, then climb into the boat and enter the column of darkness. What if there's nothing? If you wish to return to the world above, climb aboard and enter the light. What if I don't wish to? Hmm. I don't want to enter the world above. Do I? Yeah, I don't want to do that. I think it's just giving me the opportunity to prepare for the battle. I don't know. It seems like that's the only way to go, though. Climb aboard and enter the light. What if I was to climb aboard and go this way? Nope. That's a dead end. Well, I don't know. Let me just see what happens. Seems like the only way to go is this way. Now where am I? Oh, we're in the... We're in the Forbidden Fortress. Let me go back. Okay, it did say something about the hilt of my enemies. So, let's get out of the boat. Now, where do we find the hilt of his enemies? The hilts of the swords, or maybe it said my followers or something. The sword hilts of my servants who lurk deep in the darkness shall be the guideposts to that point to me. What would, what would happen if I just did this? Oh, that sounds like death. <laughs> oh no, it's not. Oh. Oh my. Jeez. Can I kill these things? What are these? They're like, they're phantom ganons, aren't they? Uh. Yeah, okay, so we need to find the real one. The hilt. Of my enemies. No, the hilt of my servant points the way. Do you think that's it? Or let me pick this up. I don't know. I'm going this way. Maybe they strategically fall. Oh, I just can't get over how it sounds just like uh, Phantom Ganon from... Well, and Ganondorf from Ocarina of Time. Which makes sense. It's supposed to be the same guy, but still. It's a completely different game, you know? Oh, I know what to do. Oh, that, that looks big. Okay. I know what to do. That's big. No. Should I try it? Oh, never mind. <laughs> Bad idea. Uh, I was going to try to deflect what he was throwing. No. Oh, that actually worked. And he got stunned. Okay. You just gotta do the timing right. Oh, jeez. I did actually get him, though. Uh, he's just giant. Ugh. Well, I hit one back at him. Oh, 
Come on. Yes. Very nice. Sword hilt. Okay. Another one? Okay, we're getting the good noise. So I think... I think we're doing okay. Oh, jeez. Oh my gosh. I didn't think I was going to get another one of those. We got him. Well, that looks pretty obvious. Okay, we got the noise again. I don't know how many of these we're supposed to go through. Oh, shoot. Huh. Yes. <laughs> that one faces this way. I hope I'm interpreting this correctly. If it meant the other way, it would have said blade, right? Not hilt. Okay, more of these. Oh, jeez. I don't know how many more of those hits I'm going to be able to take. This way. Where's he at? I feel like we're just getting practice in for the main boss, right? Oh, jeez. Man, I'm gonna rely on my fairies, basically, to help me out. Yep. Fairy, please. Where is he? I'm not really sure. Maybe I could do a spin. Oh, that works so much better. Okay, now we know the trick. Spin attack it is. Oh, does this room look different? Yes, this is different. Uh, okay, it's just another phantom Ganon, though, so... Oh, boy! <laughs> yes! <laughs> okay, I think we... Uh, okay, I was like, whoa... Oh. The lock, though. I think we passed the test. Now, what could this be? Boss key or something? Oh, oh, light arrows. When you take out your bow, use ZR to change your arrowheads. The sacred light of these arrows can pierce pure evil itself. Are you telling me we're not going into the Ganondorf fight with full health? Okay, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna go ahead and get set to the light arrows. Ooh, okay, here we go. Now what? Oh, maybe they can break this? Hmm, what about this? Well, shoot. Wait. Oh, gosh. There's a... There's another enemy here. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, what? Oh, no. Uh, do you think I should use the light arrows on him, maybe? Oh, my gosh. I just love that music. Yeah, I think we gotta use the light arrows. All right. Come on, then. Oh, wow. Just like an ocarina of time, banish him to the gap between dimensions. I guess I... Do I need to follow the sword hilt this time? What about this? That doesn't do anything. Neither does that. Well, I don't know. I guess I'll follow the sword hilt again. But let me do this. Maybe you have to go through it twice or something. Once uh, to get the arrows and then the second time to use the arrows on him. I really, I don't know. I don't know. Let me take a look. So nothing in here's changed. Let me drop back down here. Okay. 
This is already open. Oh. Oh. Huh, this doesn't feel right. Something doesn't feel right. Let's do a, uh... Oh, oh. I wanted to get a hurricane spin attack thing in, but they may not let me. Okay, it's kind of weird. There's, like, no enemy music. I think I... I don't know. I think I might have done something wrong. Okay, the door is unlocked now. Well, let me stock up. Wow. Not that I really, I guess, need any of this stuff besides the hearts. The hearts would be nice. Okay. Well, what did I miss? Gosh, I don't know. Hm. So now we're back up at the top. But what to do now that I have the light arrows? I mean... I, d I don't know. It seems like now we should be able to... Well, look at that. Oh, let me try this. Oops, wrong button. Ah, jeez. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Ooh, okay. Let's check these jars. Okay, arrows. Oh, that's actually good because, I mean, I had 60 or something like that, but I, I always like to go into the boss fights, you know, fully stocked. <laughs> um, I think we have another one on our tail. Wow, one hit. Sweet. Okay, let's go. Is that a dark nut? It is. They seriously love these enemies. They're like everywhere. Ooh. They're definitely getting easier though. I'll say that. Oh, he's not dead. Don't give him a chance to get his weapon back. He's still not dead. What the heck? There we go. Was this like the never ending staircase? How many flights of stairs do we need? Okay, well, geez. What the heck? Getting beat up by the pigs. No, no, no. No! Goodness. Hearts, please. Okay, I think we're ready. Or whatever is through this door, could this finally be... Oh, two dark nuts. <laughs> Thought we were there. We are not. Helm splitter! Woohoo! <laughs> Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, just stay there, guys. Yeah! Oh, wrong button. Trying to get the karate chop on me. Wait for that A command. There it is. Still not down, though. Is he down? No, wow. Okay. Now, surely. Okay. Now we have been deemed worthy to pass through the door. Okay. I think we're ready to go. Should we drink grandma's soup? I almost want to wait until... I don't know. Let's just do it, I guess. <laughs> There's two helpings in there, so let me um, take it off. So I don't accidentally do that again. Because don't I have like double the damage or something like that as long as I've got 
Um, before I take the first hit. What? Are those, like, curtains? Is that Zelda? Oh my gosh! You've got her tucked in bed. Weird. He must have her in some kind of a sleep or trance or something. Do you sleep still? Wait. Do not be so hasty, boy. Oh no, what's he doing? I can see this girl's dreams. Oceans, 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 oceans. <laughs> oceans as far as the eye can see. Well, she's a pirate. They are vast seas. None can swim across them and none yield... Oh, they yield no fish to catch. What did the king of Hyrule say? That the gods sealed Hyrule away? And they left behind people who would one day awaken Hyrule. How ridiculous. So many pathetic creatures scattered across a handful of islands drifting on this sea like fallen leaves on a forgotten pool. What can they possibly hope to achieve? Don't you see? All of you. Your gods destroyed you. <laughs> I've been waiting for you, boy. For one like you. Yes, for the hero. <laughs> Do not betray my expectations. Oh gosh, why is he making that noise? That sounds gross. Oh boy. I mean, we can't have a Ganondorf fight without a beast Ganon, right? Link looks terrified, and actually, maybe I am too. What is that? My first thought was dragon, but I don't think so. I think it's just a big monster. Oh, jeez, he's huge. And he's a puppet. Um, I don't even know what to do, so... Maybe cut the strings with the boomerang. Cut the strings, cut the strings. Ah. It is, are the strings cutting? Where's my boomerang? Okay. Uh, yes, I think. I don't like that it hits him first. Okay. Let me wait for his attack. Okay, get up, 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 up. No, shoot. Oh my gosh, I can't see. Too close, too close. And we've got one in the tail and that red one, which I don't know if that... Whoa, where'd you come from? Hmm, what do I do? He's swinging around uncontrollably. No, don't hurt me, bats. I've got grandma's soup in me. Oh my god. Ruiners of the soup. What do I do? No, that doesn't, doesn't seem to be it. Well, he's back on strings. But I didn't really get any hits on him, though. Okay, we broke some strings. I don't know why I can't reach the string on the tail, though. Maybe the tail needs something else, some other kind. Oh, we got it. There we go. Now we just have this one. Got it. Now he's just tied by that, and I don't think I can actually break this. Yeah, no. So what's... Oh, there he goes. There he goes. He's like a big carnival, or a, a parade balloon. What do I do? Oh, there's something on his tail. Let me go check this out. It, it's really wanting me to target his head. Hey, it feels like a big balloon, too. 
What is the trick? Oh, the arrows of light, maybe? That didn't, didn't seem like it did anything. Doesn't seem like it's doing anything. All right, his strings are back. What is the trick to this? Cutting his strings. I think he's gonna, yeah, there we go. Come in with the attack. One left, and then we just have this string. Can I cut that one? I don't know. Okay, what is the deal here? What do I do? Arrow of light? Like, nothing is really working. I wonder if there's anything in my surroundings that I should be using. Okay, get out of there, Link. I, I really feel like I've not done any damage to this guy yet. Oops, wrong. Oh, wrong thing. Oh my gosh. The thing on his tail does look like something that it should be interested in. All right, now he's just spinning and spinning. Got it. Oh, heart. And now he's just a limp noodle. Ugh, he fell on me, dude. That doesn't do anything. What about the boots? What about the boots? Because there's, um... Can I grab these strings? What the heck are you supposed to do? I think the tail is the important part. So let me try something. If he'll just stop moving. Okay, yes. Do whatever you're doing. Shoot, man. Um... He's so fast. I want to just aim for the tail string, which is tough because he's... Here we go. Uh, Did I get the tail? I don't know if I got the tail or not. I don't think I did. The tail's the hardest one to get. Okay, now he's spinning wildly. That's... I don't have time for you. Oh, no! I can't see what I did there. I think there's still... Okay, so there's still maybe an opportunity here. There we go. Okay, now what does this do? Oh, maybe the light arrows? Ah, yes. Okay, finally some progress. I knew that thing was important somehow. Okay, now he's spinning wildly out of control. Let's just try to aim for that tail. Tail string. Did we get it? Uh, doesn't look like it. Come on! Boomerang, yes! Okay, now we just need to... Oh, shoot, I missed. Oh, come on! Stop moving! There we go! More bats. Oh boy. While he's spinning, it might. Oh, wrong, wrong item. No, more bats. Come on. Um. Uh, while he was spinning, is really the best time to try to get that tail string. Ouch. Oh, wrong tool. There we go. Was that. Was that it? No, I don't think it was. Ah, yes, that was it. Okay. Now, where is it? Oh, yes. Such a weird form. It's like the giant parade balloons. Oh, that's... <laughs> that sounds ominous.
Oh my goodness. That is even bigger than the last one. Okay. So where did he go? Uh, whoa. Oh, he still has this though. Maybe. Nope. I bet that's still going to be the weak point. It looks like a Sheikah bomb. Oh, oh, the floor. It's just like Twilight Princess. The the fight with um, Yetta. I want to be toward his butt. We want the butt. Ah! Okay, arrow. Yes. Oh, listen to this music. Yes. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Spin, spin, spin. <laughs> the music got really cool. And... Oh, yeah. Ugh. You know, I just realized there were no light arrows involved in the fight in Tears of the Kingdom. When light arrows are like a pretty big piece of the fight in most other Ganondorf fights, you know? I don't know why he has a Sheikah bomb on his butt. So that's two monster forms. I've never seen Ganondorf turn into any of these. And, well, you know, he's just on a string, so maybe this is just a puppet. Well, I don't know if I can make that shot. That seems pretty far out there. Hmm. Oh, jeez. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Um, does he ever stop? I don't know that I can actually hit this. It's... He's moving so fast. Oh! Uh, let me... Jeez. Um, what if I try to break the string? Wow, this is not working out at all. Let me try to aim for his string. But it doesn't lock on, so I don't think this is going to be it. Where are the bombs? Oh, it's him. like throwing himself into the wall. What the heck am I supposed to do? Let me see if I can just hit the thing on his tail with my sword. I don't think so, but maybe it doesn't really help that it wants me to lock onto his head. I don't think that's going to work. Okay, we're just going to have to do it with the bow and arrow. It's Oh, jeez. And back around. Oh, that seemed like a hit. Come on. <sighs> the music sounds very watery. <laughs> oh, wait, did that... That almost seemed like it stunned him for a second. Okay, get these things off me. I need... Magic! And hearts. Oh, magic. No hearts, though. Okay, let me just try. Yeah, that does nothing. Absolutely nothing to him. Ah! There's got to be something I'm missing. Ah, jeez. That thing is so hard to dodge. Okay, let me try and see if we can get some items. Particularly magic. Get off of me. Oh, come on. He's dropping a lot of these. Oh, jeez. I just want to try to restock, but... Oh, my gosh. Okay, we're just going to try to go for it. That was a hit! Get off me. Trying to do a spin attack here. Item, item, yes. No, 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 no. Oh, gosh. Got me with the tail swing. Oh, my gosh. You can stun him. Quick, quick, quick. Wow. And then he just goes back to wildly flailing. Okay. Um. Oh, hearts. 
Shoot. If he'll come right at me, I maybe can stun him. But, nope. He, oh, well, we got him. Well, well, that was only seconds worth of a stun. All right, we're going to shoot. Let me wait for him to maybe get near the walls. Yeah, like this is some... Nope. Jeez, we got lucky, I think, with that stun. Thank God for the fairies. Arts. Oh my gosh, get off of me. Okay. If he'll stay going in a circle for a second, maybe. Oh, that almost seemed like a hit. Where are you? <gasps> that was lucky. <laughs> that was lucky. So is Ganondorf up there in the ceiling or something? Because that was surely just a puppet. Zelda, wake up! I'm struggling. Yes, surely you are the hero of time reborn. <gasps> oh no! Your time has come. Come now, stand before me. He's just holding Zelda there. Like a limp noodle. Where are we going? Where am I? Oh, I guess out the door. There's no items in here. So, well, there's those. Do you think I should attempt to hit these? Oh, they don't even, they don't even come down. Hmm, that's locked. Can we climb the puppet string? No. Crouch? He's looking up. Ah, oh, there we go. So let me, um, let me wait for it to stop spinning. Can't you press, yeah, R, and then just climb up. Okay, final showdown. Interesting first forms for Ganondorf there. Uh, yeah, the the puppet thing was pretty cool. The big spider form, I think, I thought was the coolest for sure. So, can't wait to see what's coming. And, like, is Zelda gonna wake up? I'm pretty sure that I have heard you guys do some of this fight together. Oh, I was like, no way did I just climb up this whole thing and it's a dead end. Is it? Uh, maybe there's a hook shots location. It just like went. Uh, oh, there's a whip. But what would that do for me? Hold on. Do I go up? I guess so. I can't reach. What if I jump over here? Where are we going, though? Can I look around? Hmm. I, I don't think this is... Well, there's jars up there. How do I get up there? Um, hmm, this is odd. Very odd indeed. I feel like I'm going to fall all the way back down to the ground. Yeah. Okay. What the heck? It feels like there should be a hookshot location or something around here. Can't hookshot to that. Well, what about, I mean, sure, I don't think I want to break these, but can you? No. Oh, okay, I guess I missed a minute ago that you could actually just climb right up the grappling hook. Okay, so now we're up here where all these jars are. Please be lots of hearts. Thank goodness. He really wrecked me in that last phase. 
And here's another grappling hook. So, okay, let's climb this. Up we go. It's very awkwardly quiet in here. Uh, absolutely, like, no music at all. Do you think I should go over here and get this jar? Tempting me way over here. Fairy, okay, that's... Fair, I guess. Maybe I would have rather pocketed that, but that's okay. There might be another one over here. Or there might be bombs. Magic. Nothing. Another fairy. Okay, let me pocket that one. Because then we'll have two. Just in case this boss fight ends up being really difficult. Ah! What have I done? Oh my gosh. I hate myself. This is why you never leave your bottles. Oh, that's like such a rookie mistake. I don't want to go in that. Do I? Don't think I do. Okay, I think we want to go out the window. Oh, I'm so annoyed about that fairy. Can't believe I did that. Alrighty, let's go see what's out the window. Oh, we're on the tippy top of the tower. My country lay within a vast desert. When the sun rose into the sky, burning a burning wind punished my lands, searing the world. And when the moon climbed into the dark of night, a frigid gale pierced our homes. No matter when it came, the wind carried the same thing. Death. <laughs> it looks like it's killing Link, too. <laughs> oh, Zelda. But the winds that blew across the green fields of Hyrule brought something other than suffering and ruin. I coveted that wind, I suppose. It can only be called fate that here I would again gather the three with the crests. That I should lay my hand on that which grants the wishes of the beholder. That when power, wisdom, and courage come together, the gods would, no, would have no choice but to come down. The power of the gods, the Triforce, he who touches it will have whatever he desires granted. Already the crest of wisdom is mine. All that remains. <laughs> no. You can't have it. I feel like he's just going to kick her right off the edge of this tower. Oh, jeez. Oh my gosh, that face. That was terrifying. No! Oh, that was almost deadly. Link is getting the tar beat out of him. Zelda, wake up! Do not fear. I will not kill you. I merely have need of the power that dwells within you. How's he gonna... How's he gonna get it out of him? Now, let us put an end to that which binds us together. No! Oh no! He's... Is he taking it? We can't fight him with all three pieces. Oh my gosh, no! Oh, jeez. Isn't it just gonna split into three again? Like, isn't that the whole story? Like... If somebody with evil intent touches it, it'll split into three. Gods, hear that which I desire. Expose this land to the rays of the sun once more. Let them burn forth. Give Hyrule to me. There's n Oh, he who touches it will have whatever desire, whatever he desires granted. Now that's the king's hand. That's what you said, is it not, Ganondorf? He's like, I'm gonna touch the butt. <laughs> oh my goodness. He's speaking. Gods of the Triforce. Hear that which I desire. Hope. I desire hope for these children. Give them a future. 
Wash away this ancient land of Hyrule. Let a ray of hope shine on the future of the world. Oh my gosh, I didn't expect him to speak. That's so cool. Touch it. Touch it. And let our destinies finally be fulfilled. Ganondorf, may you drown with Hyrule. So he wished for hope. And for us to have a future. And Ganondorf thinks that's funny. Oh! We're, are we drowning? He thinks that is hysterical. <laughs> Absolutely hysterical. <laughs> it's just getting better and better. Is Zelda gonna wake up? This is foolishness. A future for you? The sword! What are you laughing at, Ganondorf? You're insane! Zelda's got the sword! Link, I'm sorry, I overslept. I'll say. I think it's time for us to say goodbye to this place. We must return to the world above, back to our ocean. <laughs> Very well then, allow me to show you. Your future. Yes, allow me to show you just what help you have. See how much your precious Triforce is worth. Oh boy, so this is legit the fight then. This is it. And we've got Zelda. I'll use this bow to cover you. Attack him as best you can. Okay. Attack him as best you can. And she's going to cover me with the bow. Well, he's blocking all of my hits, so... Oh, jeez. Um, whoa. Whoa! Okay, let me get my bearings. Um, do you think I should use my shield? Can this waterfall get out of my way? Oh, she got him. Wow, he is a monster. He's a beast with that... with those swords. Oh, listen to that music. How cool is that? And he dodged the arrow. Okay, let me... Oh, ow. Oh my gosh! Okay, what is the trick here? He's dodging those things. I'm not sure if that was a hit or not. I don't think it was. <laughs> he stops to laugh. Oh, she got him. Okay, back up, back up, back up. I want Grandma's soup. Grandma, save me. Grandma's soup coming in. Okay. Come on, Zelda. We need you. You gotta hit him, Zelda. Yeah, those aren't those aren't actually hitting hitting him. Oh, he took a oh, he took a heart. He's really good, I'll tell you that. For as big as he is, you wouldn't think he'd be so fast, but he really is. But did we get a helm splitter on him? We did! Okay, that was cool. That kick? Oh, she got him. Oh. What was that for? No, 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 no! Not Zelda! Hello? Jeez, we just stood there and watched. Uh, now what? I can't use my bow. Wait, she, did she take my bow? She took my bow. A little thief. Come on, give me the A command. Oh, shoot. Did I? Oh, I got it. Yes. Ouch. Oh, jeez. Getting really nervous that I didn't save that second fairy. Back up. Oh, she's awake. Come on, Zelda. Those swords he has, do you think they are engraved with Ko Ko Kume and Kotake? His surrogate mothers like they are in tears? I missed that. <gasps> Did it? No, missed it, missed it. Get out of there, Link. Oh my gosh. 
Yes. No, he blocked me from behind. Ouch. Ah. Oh my gosh, dude. He's blocking me from behind. Link, you have to distract him. Are you ready? I'll aim for you. Use your shield. Do you get it? Aim for me. Use my shield. Okay. Um, oh, hold on. I'm not ready. Am I ready? Zelda. Oh, oops. Uh, I'm not really sure what's supposed to be happening here, but did that work? I don't think it did. Ow. Are you ready? Okay. Um, yes, but hold on. <laughs> she shot me. She shot me. I know. I know. I'm trying to get out of here. Oh my gosh. Okay, shields up. Do it, do it, do it. There we go. Holy moly. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> wow. Yes. That was cool. The <laughs> wow. The arrow deflect, the sword right through the skull. The wind. It's blowing. Wow. Oh, and then he turns to stone. That is so cool. <laughs> Link is like, I barely survived. Link. Oh gosh, I thought that was Ganondorf. My children, listen to me. I have lived regretting the past and I have faced those regrets. If only I could do things over again, not a day of my life has gone by without my thoughts turning to my kingdom of old. I've lived bound to Hyrule. In that sense, I was the same as Ganondorf. But you, I want you to live for the future. There may be nothing left for you, but despite that, you must look forward and walk a path of hope, trusting that it will sustain you when darkness comes. Such a fun fight. Farewell. This is the only world that your ancestors were able to leave you. Please forgive us. Wait, you could, you could come with us. <laughs> yes, of course, we have a ship. We can find it. We will find it. The land that will be the next Hyrule. So. Ah, oh, but child, that land will not be Hyrule. What? It will be your land. Oh gosh. Are we being chucked out of the sea? Oh, we're in like protective bubbles. Wimblink! Oh, he's sending us away. And the sword though. He's like the captain. He's got to stay with his ship. I have scattered the seeds of the future. What does that mean? Sounds like something the great Deku tree would say. And there we are. Oh, and she's back to being Tetra now, which is interesting. Oh, this, this cutscene is showing on my gamepad, too. That's interesting. Oh, is that, um, Kamali? I think it is. <laughs> oh, oh, it's her ship, the pirate ship. <laughs> uh, 
And there's Errol. Oh, yay. How cute. I also love that I get to see it on the gamepad, too. I don't know why that makes me so happy. Oh. So I guess we just go back to living like normal. They said something about trying to find a new home. Oh, look at her. She's such a cutie. Oh, gosh. I forgot her name. Oh, Medley and Makar. Oh, so they don't have to live forever in the temples? Oh, that makes me feel better because I felt really bad that they were just going to be left there, like, to die for the rest of their days. And maybe they have to go back. I'm not sure. Oh, and that's the end. They all lived happily ever after, maybe. Ah, <laughs> uh, that was such a cute game. I'm so glad that I finally got to play. Oh, there's Grandmammy. So glad that I finally got to play that game. It's honestly, it's just so cute and like lighthearted. And the animation style is very different, but I think it's very fitting for this game. I wouldn't want like, you know, all the Zeldas to be like this, but I think I like having the, the mix that we do. But the story to this one was really cool. It was fun, you know, um, just kind of being off to save Link's sister. And then you do save the sister, but it's kind of like after that, you can't just go back home because there's still the evil threat out there of Ganondorf and uh, yeah, that one rescue scene where I think, is that where we found out that, well, no, that was, hmm, let me think. I think that was when we found out that Tetra was Zelda, that one where we went to confront Ganondorf after saving Errol, and then Valu rescues us from the window. Well, it wasn't Valu, it was the Rito, and then Valu, I guess he flames Ganondorf's, um his fortress there, that was like the coolest thing I think I've ever seen. Uh, that was like, that rescue mission was just so much fun. But the final fight was also really fun too. The, the, the whole thing where you had to deflect the arrow like that, it, that was really cool. And working with Zelda is always so much fun. You got to do it a little bit in most of the other games, I guess. Well, I don't know, the ones that I've played anyways. Ocarina of Time, she's there on the sideline. She's not really doing much except screaming every time you get hurt. And then Twilight Princess, she's there a lot. Uh, I think she rides on the back of your horse with you and shoots arrows at him, which is really cool. Um, okay, those are the two that I can think of where she's actually involved. In Breath of the Wild, she really just kind of talks to you. Oh, but Tears! Okay, she's got a pretty big part in Tears, and I think... That's, that's really cool. I always like sections kind of where you get the interactions with Zelda because it just doesn't happen that often. Oh my gosh, the great Deku tea, tree with his warts. <laughs> I'm sure that there's a ton of stuff in this game that I missed. Obviously, I wasn't 100%ing the game or anything like that. And I was just kind of playing without trying to not look at guides as much as possible and just kind of following the game and also your guys' comments. Those were really fun to follow. The hints and stuff that you guys were leaving in the comments and little tips and tricks and stuff. Those were super useful and made the playthrough for me a lot more fun. Um, just to kind of experiment with the things that you guys were leaving in the comments. So I hope you guys enjoyed that too. That was a lot of fun. For the enemies and stuff in this game, man, did they really love the Dark Nuts or what? <laughs> Those things were like everywhere. I finally, now in like the last like three episodes or so, finally got better at fighting those things. Oh, there's the giant bird. That was a cool fight too, unexpected. Oh, and then the little, um, oh, what do you call them? The, not cliffhangers, the, um, Oh, geez. I don't know why I can never think of words on the spot. Um, plot twist, basically, I guess, where the King of Red Lions turns out to be the king of Hyrule, and then, of course, Tetra being Zelda. Those were pretty fun. 
to come across. Now, I didn't know some of this stuff going in because obviously this game's, you know, older. So I've seen, uh, you know, lore and stuff about it. But it was really fun seeing it in real time in person as I played through it myself. It was a lot of fun. I would definitely play this game again and add it to my list of must play Zelda games. I did find it sometimes a little bit confusing to know what exactly to do. Um, especially the most confusing part, I think, for me was finding... So after... Let me think. After we found out that Tetra was Zelda and we were down under the ocean, we came back up and the King of Red Lions basically... I think he... Is that the, at what point he gave us the Incredible Map? I'm not sure where we got the Incredible Map. Did that come from Tingle? Anyways, I basically had like a few different ways I could go where I could go chase down the Triforce pieces or I could go follow what the king was telling me to do which was go to those two locations on the map but those two locations on the map you couldn't get into them so I thought okay maybe I need to do the Triforce pieces first and oh look at them oh how cute adorable Anyways, I just found that to be a little bit confusing because it seemed like they were telling you go do this, but you don't have the items to do this. So, but what you do have in your hand is the incredible chart, which could um, be something to follow up on, but you couldn't really follow up with like, all of those either. So it was really hard to know what to do without trying to look up hints and stuff, unless you just really, really paid attention to what those fish were saying, which obviously I didn't. Oh, <laughs> why are they sad? I guess we're leaving? Maybe we're going out on another journey. But Errol got to go home. Look at the wind in my sails. Oh, it's like the outset music. Anchors away. Hold the tiller steady. As for our destination, the wind will guide us. Oh. <laughs> How fun! The thing on the front of their ship almost looks like the King of Red Lions. Oh god, was that the booger boy back there? I see him. Snotting it up. Oh! <laughs> I did not get the same, uh, like, emotional response, I guess, from playing this game that I do from the other ones. Maybe because it's just so cutesy and just feels very lighthearted. Except when Link left the first time and he has to wave goodbye to his grandma. That was so sad. I wanted to bawl my eyes out. And here we are. Back to the load screen. The game will save and make a file for a second quest. To keep your current save data, select a new quest log. Do you want to save? Let's save. So, um, you know, I actually have learned that you can um, play, if you play in hero mode, oh, I can't pick hero mode. Well, anyways, uh, if you do pick hero mode, I think you can actually uh, play in Link's blue lobster shirt through the whole game. Normal mode. I don't know why it's not looking, letting me pick the hero mode. Anyways, guys, that wraps up The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. Thank you so much for watching this series and for all of your tips and comments and uh, watching, even if you just watch and never comment. I seriously appreciate all of it. Thank you so, so, so much. And I'm really looking forward to our next venture. I hope you guys are too. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Goodbye. I'm Brittany with Desert Bee Games. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to help my channel grow, all you gotta do is hit the like and subscribe buttons below. If you'd like to see your name at the end of every video, please consider joining channel memberships right here on YouTube. Can't wait to see you there.